Pardon me, doll. Another round of Arnold Palmer's. Put it on 1673. Now, ladies, what I'm about to tell you does not leave this table. Estelle and Abe are breaking up. <gasps> you didn't hear it from me, but apparently Abe prefers blondes. Don't get your hopes up, Phyllis. Natural blondes. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Estelle. Give my regards to Abe. <laughs> <sighs> Time for Plan B. Where is Bugs? Bugs Bunny. You know him? Oh, I know him. Bugs Bunny is the worst man I've ever met. Bugs Bunny is a saint. That's what he'd have you believe. Let me guess, you met him on a tennis court? Oh, <gasps> unbelievable. Let me give you a little piece of advice. Girl to girl, if you don't want your heart shattered into a million pieces, you'll break up with Bugs Bunny today. <whistles> hey, Lola. Sorry I'm late. Oh, I'm not. I just had a very interesting conversation with an ugly woman. Ugly? Very ugly. But she told me something that has me looking at you in an entirely different way. Bugs Bunny, you are a bad boy. I've never been with a bad boy before. That makes me a bad girl. Meow! <laughs> Lola! Over here, darling! Who are they? My parents. It's about time you guys met. Be on your best behavior, bad boy. Bugs! <laughs> Lola's told us so much about you. She doesn't know anything about me. <laughs> See? Told you he was funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's wonderful. Hey, excuse me. I'll be right back. You have to end this. I don't care if she cries. I don't care that her parents are there. She's crazy. And this ends now. And you are not an ugly woman. Ooh, a mint. Thanks for the pep talk. You can do this. It's like ripping off a bandage. I don't know what it is, but it's like we complete each other. Ooh. I think he is my soulmate. <laughs> yes! What? Of course I'll marry you! Huh? <clears throat> My daughter's getting married to the future, Mr. and Mrs. Bugs Bunny. And the son I never had. No! Oh, no! Oh, oh, so romantic! Why are we clapping? One of the club members just got engaged. Darling, send the happy couple a bottle of your best bubbly. Compliments of 1673. Someone's bucking for club president. Well, you know what they say. First comes love, then comes marriage, then comes lots of bunnies and a baby carriage. <laughs> Wait until you meet Pepe. He's the wedding planner for the R-O-G-O-O-O-C-C. -C. Can't you people just say country club? Lola, mon chéri. And this must be the lucky groom. Mmm, so lucky, so, so lucky. Your wedding day is the single most important day of your life. I should know. I've been married seven times. Now, I'm seeing an outdoor ceremony. You should feel the beauty of nature embracing you as you walk down the aisle. The smell of honeysuckle kissing your cheeks as you exchange your vows. Ugh. There won't be a dry eye in the house. I'll be crying harder than anyone. What's wrong, Bun-Bun? You don't want a big wedding? Well, we can have a small wedding. Or a wedding on a beach. Or we could get married in Vegas. Or we could just go down to the courthouse right now! Or huh? we could just not get married. <laughs> what is going on with you? This isn't the bugs I know! <laughs> Love you. Don't forget we're having dinner with my parents. <laughs> mm, so lucky.